church is viewed by many as the hipster bar, full of fashion students and photography type people. To an extent, it is an accurate observation, but it would be unfair to disregard a specific outcome of this stereotype, creative street art. As street art becomes more important throughout the shortage community, more artists turn to walls to sprinkle with a bottle of paint their creativity. It's a different way of approaching. It's not commercial. The idea is to show something, to make people think something. I had considered academia, but academia, I felt, was too institutionalized, and I'm a bit too much of a people pleaser. And I was worried that if I went into academia, I would kind of, I wouldn't really have the space to develop it, the freedom. So for me, art is really, I guess, it's about freedom, the freedom to explore and explore and engage. Art is defined as the expression of human creativity and imagination. Many times, artists use their imagination to portray emotional power in what they feel, especially when it relates to current events concerning society. It's getting more acceptance. It's making the streets a cheerier place. I'd rather have this, or any of this, than all the endless adverts. We're not trying to sell anything. It engages actually with the audience directly. You get things like places like this, where people will actually come up and talk to you. It makes art more relevant to people who aren't schooled in art. They don't feel they have to go into a gallery, which for a lot of people, galleries make themselves quite an intimidating space, but the street isn't. In a world like today, full of constant media coverage of worldwide events, street artists respond with words and images painted on walls around them, hoping to make this society a more responsible one. This is just like a scream. It's an emotional moment. And I'm someone who does scream performances. I understand the need to scream. And I think street art, when it's taken to that level, gives people a, a real need to just kind of express and vent and frustrate onto the world, which I think is important. It's got to be.